so in this video we are going to discuss about the respiratory disorder all right what is disorder disorder is basically the defun dysfunctioning of the specific organ we are having a respiratory tract like from mouth to the larynx we are having the upper respiratory tract and from trachea to the alveoli we are having the lower respiratory tract if there is any infection or disorder um disease uh, no uh, if there is any kind of um, dysfunctioning in these upper tract so that will be the upper respiratory disorder if this is in this so that will be the lower respiratory disorder so first disorder we are having the sinu sinusitis sinusitis as you guys all know there is a sinusitis disease in the previous video we have discussed about the sinusitis that was what that was a hollow air space cavity all right which was in the paired form so that is the uh, that infect the upper respiratory tract all right and it is what this is the inflammation or you can say the blockade or the sinuses inflammation what is inflammation that is the response which is generated so just because of the inflammation there is the redness is there swelling can be there and if we talk about the reason or causes of the sinusitis that is the bacteria microbes can be there virus can be there any pathogen can be there so there can be the uh, any cause can be there all right so if we talk about the treatment like what is the treatment so treatment of this is basically antibacterial we can give we can give antiviral antifungal all right or you can say we can give the nasodilator or open by the steam all right this so if you talk about the causes that can be the common called virus nasal polyp can be there what is nasal polyp nasal polyp is basically the lining of nasal cavity will be increase or there will be the if there will be increase or there will be the blockage will occur so pathway will become constrict or narrow all right so we can say the dislocation of the no, nose bridge all right uh, or the changing of the location of the nasal bone and fourth can be the allergy blockage because of the dust particle and this so symptoms if we talk about of this disease that can be the breathing problem fever headache pressure in air because as you guys all know the air buccal cavity in nose these are connected with the sinuses so that can be the issue all right so the because of blockage the accumulation of the mucus will occur more all right so there will be a blockage so this is a blockage was blockage so this because of this the breathing problem can be occurred so there are three type of uh, infection duration of the sinusitis first is the acute second is the sub acute and third is the chronic and if we talk about the acute that is the short duration all right there will be the more symptom and that can be the four two to four weeks and if the disease is the sub acute which means that will be not acute not chronic that will be the uh, that disease will be the four to four, six week and if it is chronic which means that is more than six week and they are having the more duration so this was about the sinusitis